Hi, hello. This is Pramila Rao. Welcome you all to Pramila's Healthy Kitchen. Filter coffee is just not so easy. You need a filter, you need coffee powder and hot water. And there is a technique of making proper nice flavorful filter coffee. Here I have different types of filters. This is the one which I regularly use. It's a normal filter and uh, it has a funnel inside. This is also similar to the original one, but this is the latest one and it has a spout over here. This is the latest one where you can pour out the filter once it is filtered. And then this is the French press. Again, this is a different way of making coffee. Uh, this coffee is a little lighter. And then we have this small cute filter which can be used for only one cup of coffee. Now I'm going to show you how the different filters are going to be used. So I'll start with the French press. I have about 30 grams of coffee powder. I'll talk to you about the coffee powder later which blend it is. Uh, I'm going to add this and I'm going to add 350 ml of hot water. I'm going to stir it a little and I'm going to put this press back into it. Yes. Now the next one is the smaller one. I'm going to take out the funnel. I'm going to add two heaped tablespoons of coffee powder and I'm going to add I'm going to put this, this is very, very important. You have to put the filter, this funnel back into this filter. This is important. The powder is below and I'm going to pour, here I'm going to pour, I put half the filter. And I'm going to put the lid back. And the other one is the smaller one. Here again, I'm going to put one and I'm going to put because I need I want strong coffee so I'm going to put two tablespoons of coffee I put this filter back of uh, the funnel back remember this is over the cup and I'm going to pour water but full almost in the brim here again I close this this is mostly used while I'm traveling okay now I'm going to talk to you about different types of coffee beans which I placed it over here. So first I'm going to talk to you about pea berry. Pea berry has, it's very good and it has more flavors and it gives a light decoction. The next one is plantation and uh, it, it also has good flavors but different from pea berry uh, and it is more stronger. But these two together, pea berry and plantation together will be called Arabica. They come under the name Arabica. Uh, these are, this is the blend which I use, pea berry and plantation together, I use this blend. The next one is Robusta. Uh, it has different flavors and it, its flavor is completely different and it, it has the strongest decoction. Uh, it, it, I think, is a little bitter. Uh, I don't drink Robusta because it's just too strong. And this is chicory. This is not a coffee bean. It's a herb. Uh, uh, you get it powdered in the coffee shop. Um, this is basically added to any coffee powder because it complements it and it also increases the strength and the flavor. So uh, it's each person's um, uh, likes and dislikes whether to add chicory, not to add chicory to take the plain coffee. And uh, this is the blend which I use. This is Peaberry and Plantation Ben which uh, I like this flavor together, which is called uh, Arabica. Well, if you're looking from where to get the coffee powder in Pune, uh, this is where I pick it up from uh, almost since 10 to 15 years. I pick up my coffee from here and uh, 
you can ask them and they will help you with whichever blends you want as per your flavors this is our regular milk so now i'm going to show you how to make coffee healthy well i do not want to talk about whether coffee is healthy or no but i'm going to make it very healthy so that is what we are going to see today yes here you can see this is oat milk this is soy milk and this is almond milk which i have made it at home i just you just need to soak uh, oats soy beans and uh, almonds and uh, just extract the milk in case you do not want to go to the into the process of making milk at home you do get it in the market can you see i'm just shaking it a little for you to see the decoction is come up it's settled on top next the small cutty pie filter here is the decoction you, you just need to add milk you sit with your newspaper and you put the the small filter and your decoction is ready and here is our regular filter i'm going to open this but since the spout has been given we can pour it out through the spout now i'm going to warm the almond milk not boil it okay now i'm going to make coffee with the uh, decoction of french press and i'm going to add almond milk warm almond milk please do not boil it chances of curdling are more you can make it light you can make it strong as per your likes and i'm going to add a teaspoon of sugar again here it is as per your taste your almond milk french press coffee is ready now uh the filter the decoction is ready over here and i am going to add here soy milk this is warm decoction is warm soy milk again do not boil soy milk it may curdle again as per your likes you can add your milk and i'm going to add little sugar and here your soy milk coffee is ready Okay now I'm putting our regular filter coffee filter decoction and here I'm going to add oat milk here now oat milk seems to be very very thick so I'm going to stir it a little before I add the sugar now I'm going to add little sugar and your oat milk coffee is ready 